Oh, sourdough is all the rage right now. So, is it healthier for us and what is it doing with our microbiome is an excellent question. So the process of fermentation in itself is utilizing microorganisms to alter the structure and taste and nutrient composition of the bread. And so historically that was more about making sure that it was safe to eat. Fermentation is used in a lot of ways like that, thinking of yogurt and kefir, sauerkraut, kimchi, all these fermented foods um, that have natural bacteria that ferment them and make them safe to eat, so preservative of, of sorts. So with sourdough bread, what happens in the fermentation process is that it can make certain chemicals or compounds reduce in number. So for example, there's something in flour called phytates and phytates bind up minerals and other vitamin-like compounds in the flour and they actually make it really hard for our intestinal cells to absorb them. But if we go through this fermentation process to make a sourdough, those phytates actually get degraded and that frees these minerals and vitamins and other bioactive compounds so that we can absorb them and actually benefit from their health properties. The other thing that happens, also see a reduction in uh, or changes in the type of carbohydrate that become present in the flour. And so this can actually lower your glucose response, meaning that if you were to eat a bunch of carbohydrate or sugar, you would normally get this big peak in glucose. But when you go through sourdough fermentation, you actually reduce that uh, spike in glucose because it alters the carbohydrate composition of the bread so that it actually doesn't have as much of a impact on your blood sugar. 